Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me again, C. And if you're new here, please subscribe to my channel to get more travel, visa, and shopping updates. Today's video is going to be so exciting, guys, because we are going to unbox one of the most sought bag from Poland, Paris. Yay! So we got this new Poland bag, fresh all the way from Paris. And I'm so, so happy that I was able to get this bag because this is actually one of the most hard to get bags and it's always out of stock. So I'm happy that I was able to get it. I'm going to show it to you guys today. And I've already unboxed it because um, I can't wait when I get it. I can't wait to open it and have a look. But I'm still going to show it to you guys right now. So this is the box. It's actually in a new packaging. So the moment that you open it, it will give you the card and of course, everything in here. The poppers, the dust bag, and the bag itself. So which Polen bag did I get? It is actually the Seam Mini Polen in Camel. Yes. Let's open it now. Polen actually have three stores. It is in Paris, which is their flagship store, one in Tokyo, and also one in New York. Yes. The dust bag. Now let me show you my new baby. Say hi to my... Look at that! The seam mini and camel. It looks so pretty. It's so pretty, guys. I'm so in love. Look at this beauty. The Polen Seam Mini and Camel Textured Leather. Look at that. Guys, please correct me if I'm wrong. I'm not sure if the pronunciation is correct. If it's um, seam or sime, I'm not sure, but comment it down below what is the correct pronunciation. But yeah, I really love this bag. I've been looking for this bag for such a long time. And um, I'm, I'm so happy and lucky to have this because it's always out of stock. And I don't want to order it online because it's going to take like, um, I mean, it's going to cost me a lot if I order it online. And of course, I want to try it on first before I buy it. So just to let you know guys, uh, Poulen bags are actually made in Italian leather and it is being made in Spain. So let me tell you first the things that I love about this Simini bag. So first of all, I'm so in love with the color. I love neutrals. I so love neutrals that, you know, most of my bags are like brown, nude, or black yeah so i don't have that much colorful bags but uh, i love this a lot so i've been actually deciding between the camel and the cognac the cognac is so pretty it's really pretty it looks so classy if they do have it that time i would have bought it but they don't have it in stock so better luck next time for me and uh, yeah so moving on what i like about this is actually the letter i feel like um it's not prone from scratch unlike the normal lambskin bags and um, I like it because it actually has two handles so first is the short handle which is this one so if you just want to use it like as a normal handbag and it actually has the long handle yes if you want to use it as a shoulder bag Another reason why I bought this bag is because it doesn't look big and it's not too small as well. And you have the option actually to expand it. Here on both sides, there's actually a magic magnet here that you just need to unsnap it so it will look like this. Now, if you wanted it to look like more sturdy and small, you just have to put it back and automatically the magnet will snap together there you go if you have been watching me you will see that i have been into polen fairy store many times and i've been buying some um, polen bags already before so one of the questions that i actually encountered is where is the best place to buy a polen bag so polen has three stores right one in paris tokyo and in usa so my personal suggestion, guys, as a shopper and as a Poulain bag lover, you should buy in Paris. If you have an opportunity to buy in Paris, I would. Why? Because 
it costs much cheaper in Paris and you will be able to get a tax refund. Let's make a comparison. If you're gonna get the same mini bag in Paris, France, it's going to cost you 330 euros less the tax refund that you're going to get from the airport. Now, if you buy it in Tokyo, Japan, it's going to cost you 63,000 yen, while in the US, it's going to cost you 460 US dollars, yes. So as you can see, convert it based on your currency, it's way, way too cheaper in Paris, France. So that's the reason why there's like a long line in front of the store. And if you're gonna go there, you really need to visit as early as you can because they open at 10 a.m. And from 10 a.m., there's already a line outside. Yes, watch my video so you guys can see how long I fall in line just to enter the store. I remember when I was in Tokyo recently, I actually saw one lady who's wearing a sim uh, mini bag, which is in cognac, and it's so, so pretty. I really like it a lot. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to get it in Paris, so that's why I got this camel, but I'm still happy, I'm grateful. But if I would give it a chance, so my advice to you guys is check out the cognac um, sim or sim mini. It's so hard for me to pronounce. I would rather pronounce it like Syme. <laughs> Please correct me. What is the correct pronunciation? But yeah, um, Konik is so beautiful and the letter looks so classy. So check it out, guys. So what you need to put to make sure that the bag won't be deformed. As you can see, my bag has a lot of buffers in there. That's actually the one that comes in the box. So make sure if you're gonna buy in Poland, make sure that you do have the puffers because you don't know when you're gonna be needing it. You might use it also with your other bags. And they put these. I think these are to protect the edges inside. So this is how it looks inside. There. So as you can see, there's like a letter on the foundation base of the bag to protect it, to kind of protect it and make sure that it's going to be sturdy here in the bottom. I really love this bag, guys. I can talk about this the whole day. It also comes with a pouch. I like that it comes with a pouch and it's matchy with the bag. And this looks so classy as well. The camel and gold zipper hardware. So the pouch size is also not too small. So you can put a lot of things in here and it is attached to the bag. Yes, you can actually detach it. So this is where it's hooked up. Inside the bag, it actually doesn't have any compartment. So you just really have the pouch itself. So just make sure that your things are organized and you don't wanna you know, put any pen marker on your bag accidentally as this is so precious. I actually recently just bought another Poland bag, which is the Dees. And surprisingly, I got it in one of the colors that I really love. I guess you now know, but watch out in my next video. I'll be unboxing it with you guys. Anyway, guys, this bag is very lightweight. I like this a lot. You can use it for travel without bothering, you know, that your bag is too heavy on your shoulder. You can put a lot of things inside and also at the same time, you can use it for work. Yes, um, I'm going to make another video and check what fits inside the sim mini bag if a 13 inch macbook or um, laptop will fit so i'll put it on my next video and that's it for me today guys thank you so much for watching my video i hope you like my polen bag unboxing and i hope that i help you decide which polen bag you want to buy and where to buy it watch out to my next video because i'll be unboxing my new polen this bag yes one of the bags that i really wanted to have and its color I guess you guys now have an idea. So watch out in my next video. Please give me a thumbs up if you like this and subscribe to my growing channel. God bless you all and thank you for watching. I'll see you on my next vlog.